to play a role. Governors could eventually have the authority to handle security in their counties if legislation mandating them to be involved is passed by Parliament. Speaking during a consultative forum bringing together governors, the National Intelligence Service, representatives from the Senate among others, Interior Cabinet Secretary Joseph Nkaiseri said Parliament needed to come up with a proper legislation to effect the functions of the county security committees, which according to the Constitution should be chaired by governors. The constitution in 2010, pre-level of government, that is self-explanatory. Article 189, sub-article 2, is very explicit. The two governments can sit and create level. And the national parliament can do that to help us. And we can move without uh, having more problems. Section 41 provides for county policing authority, which the governor is the chairperson. And that thing is already in place. And it is, it is you. And the county commissioner is a member. So at your county level, you have the responsibility of security, so to speak. It is only you people who have not been taking this. You actually been complaining when the law has given you the authority to deal with your problem like cattle wrestling, like in the clan prison. Nkaiseri added that to boost security, the ministry will from next month on a quarterly basis fund county authorities to enable them to traverse the counties and hold barrazas. He chided governors over misuse of funds on unnecessary trips, urging them to instead use the resources to hold sensitization forums for the locals. Outgoing Council of Governors Chairman Isaac Kruto disputed claims that governors would misuse power and undermine the national government, saying the final decision on any security issues would be vested on the president. We are not proposing that we have 47 different commanders of local security. We just want collaborative methodologies. And the case, the example of Alabama mentioned, is a clear indication that in spite of the American governors, for example, having a role in security, they cannot make those commands, including mad ones. The president of the Republic of Kenya retains that last command that he can actually ensure that uh, everyone is safe and protected. Under the county policy authority, Chairman of the Senate Security Committee, Yusuf Haji, who was present, said it was time for the national government to delegate some of their security responsibilities to the governors as they had more influence on the ground. For Capital TV, I'm Jen Goin.